Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Hey, Chris. That's what people call me. Why do you only wear black t-shirts? That's what people ask me. Well, I wear more than just black t-shirts. Today is a bad example of that, but I, I do have many clothes that I could wear. It's just that I choose to wear black because I, I'm not so good at the whole color coordinating thing. And despite really only wearing jeans, uh, I do worry about my appearance. Uh, I want to be perceived as someone who isn't, how you say, awkward, color-wise. Uh, I'm not good at coordinating colors. Thankfully, there are sites and services that are good at picking up on colors and balances between colors. What? Oh, what kind of website? Oh, I'm glad you... Oh, fine, Frank. Just ruin it for the rest of us. Frank Angelone right there. He, uh, that's, that's the URL I was going to share with you. Well, Frank kind of blew the lid off that one. Colorhunter.com. You can sign up if you want. You don't need to to find what you're going to find on colorhunter.com. They have a, a set of images right here on the front page. In fact, the next time you go to look at colorhunter.com, it could be a different set of images. You could also point to an image on the web and it will give you a set of colors that are complementary within that image. What would you do with this? Well, uh, let me zoom in and show you. So right at the top, looks like we have a series of clouds and these colors. These colors work well together. They were extracted out of this image. If I go down here, it looks like uh, some people standing next to boats. These are the colors here. There's uh, some mushrooms and the colors there. Very colorful. Oh, it looks like some kind of uh, a dish of sorts, like a uh, food. Uh, then we have, I don't know what that is. Ah, there we go. This is, there's, look at, but look at this. Look at this color combo. I mean, it's just, it's nice, and I, I would be able to use these colors because, see, I don't know if you're able to, well, let me zoom in a little closer. These are their hexadecimal equivalents, okay? And you'd use hexadecimal equivalents in a photo editor, an image editor, or let's say you were designing a web page or something in HTML, you could use these colors. If you're looking for inspiration, don't need to hunt very far if you know that colorhunter.com exists now see if you were to color hunter this particular image which is just a moving image unless of course you've taken a static image in which case you can't hear me it would likely pick out that red uh the black the whiteness of my skin um what else might stand out oh maybe the uh, the silvery part of my uh notebook there uh maybe maybe uh what else what else i don't know it's a good question we don't know do not know. So, uh, no better way of finding out than to upload the image. Try it for yourself. Sign up if you want. Don't need to. Like I said, uh, it's a good way of discovering colors that you otherwise would have overlooked if you're looking for inspiration with colors. Colorhunter.com. Now, if you know of any other really cool design resources or just things that you don't see every day but you might need at some point in the future even though you don't know if you're going to need it, at that point or not until if you know of anything interesting drop me a line my email address is chris at perillo.com of course you're also welcome to stop by our community geeks.perillo.com plenty of things happening there on a daily basis if not hourly if not minutely basis there's a lot of activity geeks pretty active for being introverts and kind of socially awkward we like talking smack that's about it if you'd like to ask a few questions, get a few answers related to technology, um, you might want to stop by the chat room. Because even if I'm not participating directly, the people here certainly are. Believe me, you'll ask a question. Hopefully someone's going to answer it. Maybe you'll be the person to answer someone else's question. That's how community works. And the good news is, is it doesn't matter what color you are. Because we are a friendly sort. We geeks, we love all colors especially red well i i personally like red, red is my favorite color <clears throat> i don't know where i was going with that so i'm going to close the video we're at live.perillo.com we'll see you later